Hi there, this is Chris with CAD Dimensions. Welcome to another tech tip. At some point, you may want to change which computer you have SolidWorks activated on, or if you have multiple SolidWorks licenses, you may want to change which licenses on which machine. This tech tip will walk you through the process of taking a license on one machine and moving it over to a new one. First, you want to make sure that you know your serial number. You can find it by going to Add Remove Programs by opening the Windows Start menu and searching Add or Remove Programs, going to SolidWorks, and selecting Modify. When that loads, you will see the SolidWorks Installation Manager. You want to select Modify Your Installation and click Next, and you will see your SolidWorks serial number or potentially multiple serial numbers in these lower sections. You want to make sure to take a note of your serial number and then you can go ahead and close out of the installation manager for now. Once you know your serial number you want to go ahead and deactivate that license on the machine you will be removing the license from. To do that go to SolidWorks and we're going to go over to the help menu. In earlier versions of SolidWorks the word help is spelled out in the newer versions it is this question mark inside of a circle. And we want to go down here to Licenses. And when you hover over that, you'll see you have the option to Activate, Deactivate, and Show. We want to select Deactivate. And you'll be greeted with a window like this. You want to go ahead and select Select All, automatically over the internet. And it is required that you enter in an email address. Go ahead and select Next and it may take a moment and you will get a note that it says deactivation successful. You can go ahead and say finish and now that SolidWorks license is no longer active on this machine and it is free to be activated on a new one. Once you are on a new machine, in my case I'm still on mine but this will work on any machine, you want to go back to your list of apps and features and select modify. Again, just like we did before. The installation manager will start. You will select modify your installation and say next. And you will enter in your serial number that you had from the other machine in here. In my case, I have not changed that number, so I'm going to be leaving that as is. Then you go ahead and say next. And SOLIDWORKS will check that license as well as checking what components of SOLIDWORKS you are entitled to with that license. And it will auto-populate this list with checkboxes based on that. And it will tell you down here if it is installing any new components. In my case, we are not, so we'll just say Next. And we can say Modify Now. And it will go through the process of installing any additional components that your new license may have that, if you had a previous license, may not have been present. We can go ahead and say no thank you and finish. When you go to launch SolidWorks, you'll be greeted with the product activation window. And you want to select, I want to activate my SolidWorks product now. And we say next. And similar to the screen we saw before, we will say select all and next. And again, it will take one moment and the activation will go through and you should see activation successful, just like that. And it will give you the products that were activated, the maintenance and the expiration date and the reactivation dates here. And as you can see here, SolidWorks is successfully activated and it, you're all set to use it on your new machine. If you have any questions or run into any concerns, Feel free to reach out to us here at CAD Dimensions by submitting a ticket on our website, and we will be happy to help you out with anything at all. Have a great day.